All right, we got a very classic bully victim situation here. Except they both have psychic powers and that's that's it ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the channel my name is jack the bus or i shinobi we have episode five of our mob cycle 100 watch today called ochi musha psychic powers and me not really sure what ochi musha even remotely means but in the last episode we saw what may be an overarching pro or antagonist for the series and this other young kid named teru who is a lot like mob except actually uses his powers to be popular and it's sort of in an evil way to get what he wants we're gonna hop right into it if you're new to the channel drop us up and hit that big boy bell and let's get started time to take revenge for the body improvement club yeah like i said mob's probably the first one he's met it seems like it the way he's reacting yep and he can actually see dumble it's haunting me he says casually oh my gosh a hierarchy i was just about to say a hierarchy look at me go 45 oh it went up i think that's only three more from uh i think it started at 40 or it ended at 44 last episode a hierarchy he's like all right well there's more of us we're gonna have to figure out order somehow oh my gosh wait he touched him but he didn't move <laughs> he's gonna say let's be friends Big fish. Yeah, dude. He seems like a spoiled brat, especially with these powers. And he fails. Dude, he's so fast. Telekinesis. Is he doing it to himself? Like he's moving himself around? I get nauseous. <laughs> but it doesn't even move mob. Yeah, true. I don't think Mob will want to. I mean, he'll defend himself. You can just tell. I wonder where he learned that from. Or if he just he decided that himself that he shouldn't use his powers against people. Oh, he's just shielding himself. Oh my gosh. That's so sad. Oh, we. Oh, this is who he learned it from. Wait, did Reagan say this isn't Reagan? Hmm. It's a good role model, though. Set Mob on the right path, even if he may not feel like it sometimes. Hmm. It was! He said, like us. <laughs> okay, at least Reagan's a decent role model. Pretty admirable. He doesn't want to have to use it as a crutch. Oh my gosh. The animation is pretty insane. He's just tumbling. Oh my gosh. Working out, studying. <laughs> this kid has a very healthy outlook on life. It's crazy how different of paths he and Mob have gone down. <laughs> Dimple stepping in. Oh. Or is he sticking up for Mob? What well, does he want to kill him? Just hurt him real bad? He's like, I gotta get my revenge. Aww. That'd be a disgraceful way to win, too, wouldn't it be? Oh. He's taking a form again! Dang! I mean, Dimple got rolled by Mob, though. Wouldn't Taro be fine? Yeah, he's gonna get smacked. I like how much potential he sees in Mob, though. Oh, wait! Wait, completely? Ah! Oh, no. Oh, no. That's gonna... Oh, my gosh, Dimble! They're in, like, middle school! Dude, that's gonna set Mob off. <laughs> Just for a sec. I actually, Dimple's kind of grown on me. God dang it, I only hear Blackbeard in his voice now that, that one of the Patreon comments mentioned it. God dang it. <laughs> you seemed pretty scared at first. You're the main character. 
Robloch's mad. Spit, boy! Spit! Hmm. He's going on the offensive with his words. Anyone thinks he's better than... If anyone thinks they're better than Teru, it like sets him off. Full power, no breaks. I love the lighting around him. It's crazy. Stop that! I think you're underestimating Mob's powers. He's not even going on the offensive, Teru. God, the music is sick. Oh my gosh. Oh my! Oh no, he looks scared. He's gonna have to stand up for himself eventually. He has to. I actually think Teru would kill him. Oh my gosh. Either that or he's gonna get to the point of exploding and he won't control himself. Like what happened with Dimple? All the emotions will be stored up. God damn! No shot. Oh, it all comes back to the knives. It's a very direct analogy now. If he threatens his life, he'll have to fight back. Oh. <gasps> Cut his hair. How much of his hair? Oh my gosh, he's bald top of Teru's at 0%. How did Teru just get bodied by the eye catcher, man? Holy. That was a clean cut, Mob. Holy. I mean, you got some some strands still there, but still impressed. He's using his tie as a sword. Ochimusha. Oh, is that like a swordsman? <laughs> that shot of him. Why does he look like that? That is a swordsman, I think. It's like a way they cut their hair. I don't know. Hanazawa. Teru. They're introducing each other <laughs> as an enemy. Yeah, I feel like he's going to be like a long term rival. Oh my gosh. This animation is nuts. Ora, ora, ora. He did call himself the main character. That's right. He's lost it. Oh my god. I think he genuinely is asking that. He's like, how can I get that kind of confidence? But not in a malicious way. This is his first obstacle as the main character. Oh, he ain't gonna like that. Seeing as he has the same power. God dang you, terror is pissed. Mm. He's not as special. Oh. Dang. Mob cutting to his core. Oh my gosh. What? Dang, dude. Mob just trauma dumping. He's like, we're the same. We're the same. I think it's cutting to him because he's right. Oh! He's just straight up grabbing him. It's just pure rage taking over him. He was the popular kid and no one matched him. His ego got so big that he's, he's literally fighting Mob just because. Mob didn't even ever want to fight. He didn't take anything from him. He took from his story as the main character. Wow. Oh my gosh, he's gonna force it. Oh no, Teru. Oh no. He threw a punch. He's like, that's it? He started like last week. Oh no. I was about to say that's mom's brother. <gasps> Oh my gosh. Oh, no wonder. Oh no, he's afraid he's gonna kill Teru. He didn't let it hit a hundred. Oh my gosh. God damn. Oof. It wasn't just Reagan's words. Did he wake up? Question mark percent? 
What is that? Oh. That's actually a realistic interpretation of a blast, though. It would actually rip their clothes off. Usually in anime, they just get blown back. That's just how powerful it was. That's not mob anymore, man. It reminds me of Gon's rage, like from Hunter Hunter. He's taking his powers? Oh my gosh. It's like a demon. You messed up, brother. I don't think Bob's even in there listening. There's other people. Where is he? Where did he go? Oh my god. Did he kill him? Oh, no, because he has his powers too. Wait, it's fixed. Oh, they're alive. Dude, that that like imagery and uh, he didn't realize it until he was all the way in like the stratosphere. He's just a regular person. It like changed terror though. He has like this new outlook and it took throwing him up that high into the sky to get it. I feel so bad for her. mob though. Oh, in temple. Oh, he actually looked for him. Gosh, all of that with his brother is... Ooh. It's no wonder his brother is so closed off about Mob's powers. And he probably feels guilty, and that's why he wants powers too. He feels guilty for what happened. <laughs> no, 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 the other time. Have they never talked about it? Oh, they didn't. He doesn't want to let it bother Mob. He's trying to downplay all of it. The question is, what actually did happen to those kids? Oh. Oh, Jimusha was flying. He's going to know it was Mob. He saw it. He knows exactly the sort of... Oh, man. Oof. Holy, what an episode. Just like I, like I said, the, the imagery, everything, the, the animation, whenever a mob was getting blown away over and over and over again. I mean, and what a change of a character in Teru, too. I do like this, this outlook of him being not really even an overarching antagonist anymore, but a character for mob to grow alongside because now he has found someone like him. And although his brother is a good role model and, and Reagan's there as well, there's no one that can really understand him and his internal struggles with this power, especially from what we've seen this episode the power the struggles that he deals with in terms of being scared of whatever it is and not to say that Teru has whatever demon the mob has inside of him but he will be able to understand him to a certain extent better than everyone else but i think mob's brother is coming more and more and more into the picture and i think aside from wanting to also have psychic powers i think he's just concerned about mob in general i'm not really sure but a showstopper of an episode for sure if you are new to the channel don't forget to drop a sub so you don't miss the next episode and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace peace